First of all, I want to thank you guys for com coming out and covering Penn State football like always. Uh, I want to thank the fans. We had a great crowd, 110,830, second, second largest, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> second largest crowd in Beaver Stadium history. Uh, that was awesome. When you look at the game, I just thought we played really good complimentary football, offense, defense, uh, and special teams. Obviously, our defense played a suffocating style of, of D, uh, and we're able to get turnovers, and we're extremely ball aware. But the other thing is, again, we didn't turn the ball over on offense either. Uh, special teams, I thought we, we did a really nice job. Obviously, their punter is, is special. He is a phenomenal punter, so that was, that was challenging. He put us in some tough spots, you know, especially rolling to your right which to me, whenever you go against a rugby punter and they roll to the right, the punt returner is going to cheat and work that way. Well, then he started kicking it diagonal across the field. I don't know how you really defend that. And then he got the roll. So that was impressive on their part. Some kind of interesting facts. Uh, we only allowed 76 yards uh, in the entire game. That's the 10th fewest in school history. Um, Iowa only had four first downs in the entire game. Fourth fewest uh, allowed in Penn State history. Offense had four scoring drives of 10 plus plays, which also went hand in hand with a possession time of 45 minutes and 27 seconds, which I've never seen before. Um, we've scored 30 or more points 11 times in a row now. That leads the nation. Nittany Lions have also scored in 28 straight quarters. That's the longest street in the country. So just a ton of stuff to be proud of. Uh, won the turnover battle. We know how important that stat is. Uh, we did not win the explosive play battle, but I do think we grinded that game out, which when you're playing a team like Iowa, you can't get bored of grinding it out. Going forward on fourth and one three times, picking it up. We got our third down percentage better in the second half than the first half. But you know, their style of defense, they're going to make you grind it out in the run game. They're not going to give up big plays. They played soft in the secondary and kept everything in front of them. So would we like to be more explosive? Yes. But I don't know if necessarily that was important uh, in this game the way it played out. We won the third down battle. We won the sack battle. Again, our defensive line is doing a great job. We had three sacks and a ton of pressures. Um, not a whole lot of people talk about our offensive line. Did not give up any sacks. That's huge as well. Uh, we tied the penalty battle in terms of number, but not yards. We lost it in yards. Uh, and then field position uh, battle, their punter dominated that stat. So.